In Nigeria, whenever someone is celebrating birthday, we post the person picture on our WhatsApp status to celebrate the person. During my birthday, there was no exception to this. Some of my friends and even my brother asked me for my pictures and I was like, Are you kidding me? They don't have my pictures. Well, I understand. It means they don't know about Google Photos or they know about Google Photos. But they don't know how to use it. And that is why I'm making this video. Google Photos is an infinite tool you can store, organize, and access all your photos and videos in one place. It is available in Android devices on iPhone. It is a default image viewer on Android devices, but on iPhone, you have to download it on Apple Store. These are the powerful features of Google Photos, which makes it a must have for anyone who takes photos and videos regularly. 1. Google Photos can automatically back up all your photos and videos in the cloud, ensuring that you never lose your precious memories, that is, your photos and videos. 2. It uses AI powered algorithms to automatically organize your photos and videos based on people, places, and things. You can search for specific photos or videos by keyword or even by the people or places featured in them. 4. Google Photo makes it easy to share your photos and videos with friends and family, either via a shareable link or by inviting them to a shared album. Another is, it offers a range of powerful editing tools including filters, cropping, and brightness adjustments to help you get the most out of your photos and videos. Six, you no longer have the stress of running out of storage space on your phone. With Google Photos, you can easily remove your photos and videos that are not already backed up to your Google account. This means you won't have any need to delete photo or videos to pre up space on your phone again. The seven, you can automatically create collage, movie, animations, and many more using your photos and videos. Alternatively, you can create them manually. Eight, there's something we call memories in Google Photos, just like the memories you have on Facebook. You usually see on your Facebook account, where Facebook reminds you of your previous photos you posted on Facebook. The same applies to Google Photos. It reminds you of photos that are backed up on their cloud. It can be a year, two years, or based on certain events or activities. Nine, this is a new feature on Google Photos. It does what we call a logged folder. The logged folder is simply a special folder on your Google Photos app on Android that is protected with your screen lock. Anything in the lock folder is hidden from the rest of the device and it is not backed up to the cloud. And the last feature of Google Photos is the ability to download an entire album. That if you want to download all the albums on your Google Photos, you simply click a button and it will download to whatever device you wanted to download, whether it's your PC, tablets, and so on. So as you can see, Google Photos is a great and excellent tool you can use to preserve your memories. However, Google Photos can consume a lot of mobile data if it's not properly set up. So in the next video, I'll be showing a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to properly set up your Google Photos. I will see you in the next video.